Hello there everyone. Okay, so this one has taken me a long time to do. This has been a farm that I have been wanting to do from the moment I started this game. But, as people who've done this farm will know, it is such a side farm, it is hard to do. We're talking about Ray Jedi training. So, this the reason for this farm being difficult for those of you who just come into the game and still wondering, which might be why you're on my channel, it's these pair. Vet Chewy and Vet Han. Now, Vet Chewy and Vet Han are both on Cantina nodes, so in theory, they're quite friendly to get. The difficulty is, they just take such a long time as they're both competing for the same energy. So, it's much easier now than it was when the game first launched, but it is still relatively difficult. So, you, while you're working on the Vets, you can get Ray Scav, Finn and BB-8, BB-8 via the First Order event. You can get all of them geared up and ready. I'm going in like this. I'm not 100% sure if I'll be able to do it. I may need to rework some mods, add a little bit of gear, but this is what I'm going to go in with right now. So, without further ado, let's get into the event. Let's see how difficult it is. So, tier one. We need six star characters, Ray Scav, Finn, BB-8, and I know that for a fact from this step on, seven star. So, it's why I've left it to the last minute. So, with this team, we are going to just sub in Finn Lead. Oh, hang on, Finn Lead's already there, that's great. Now, I've got the Zeta on the leadership. I believe it's a good Zeta all round, and I am going to gear Finn up from more than nine. I'm going to try and get him to gear 13 so that I can use him in the raids. But uh, for now, he'll do. So, let's go in. In your own time, game. <laughs> we gotta move! Okay, let's do a little wiggle with BB, and let's just smack this uh, right Stormtrooper. And we're going to just give this one a smack, and let's just do a basic here. Go and say, with this team, you want to try and get uh, Foresight and Exposes going. So, for, uh, Foresight is especially good with Ray Scav, because she is a little bit brittle, but... Uh, with Expose, it just keeps Termiter ticking over with Finn's lead, so try to keep doing that. I, I laugh because I haven't actually used Resistance a lot. This is why I want this event to be completed, because they're a good team. It's just I have never had a chance to actually use them. So I'm learning as I go along here, but I know the basics. You know, I've seen other people do it, so I'm looking forward to seeing it myself. Okay, so we're doing a wiggle. Uh, let's do the first special for Ray. Not a lot of damage going around from there, so uh, we should be fine here. Just keep uh, sending out Illuminated Destiny. Let's give this Stormtrooper a smack. Uh, let's do a big hit there. Lovely. Do another wiggle. And the basic finishes off. Lovely. Okay. I just realised I'm popping out of the green screen a bit, but oh well. We've got 50 shards of Rage at our training. Let's move on. So, tier 2. Um, for the record, I didn't read the description like I usually do, but the first one was BB-8 has been spotted, evade the first order, and escape Jakku. This time we've got four of the five characters, it's just Ray Scav we're missing, and it says the first order has attacked Maz's castle, band together to hold together the relentless onslaught. Okay. So, uh, this is the crew we're using. Gear 7 Vet Horn. I am not convinced this will be enough, but also... I do know that it might not be needed. I'm going to try and cope without. So let's see. I'm really trying to undergear this, which is rare for me. I usually go over, but I am going to try and just go under. Uh, beeper, whoop, rawr. <laughs> and yeah, I'm with Finn. What? <laughs> okay, let's get the wiggle moving. And uh, we'll do an AoE. Nice ability blocks out there. Uh, not great for Veton getting all that damage, so we're going to do that. And let's stun the officer. Nice speed down. Let's start uh, wiggling again. Let's wiggle again. Okay, we've got basic. Oh, no, basic even. We're going to do illuminated... Uh, secret and dial. That's it. I get my words mixed up. Okay. Yeah, taunt could be annoying here, but we'll just have to keep riding it. Let's just keep spreading the secret intel. Do the AoE. And we're going to do the Expose. Like I say, Expose is a great uh, bit of synergy for, for the resistance, so whenever you get a chance, use it. 
first turn with Finn, I didn't for the simple fact that um, I wanted to try and clear the stun off Vetarn. Also, just as a little pointer, um, I have got Zeta on BB-8, so that's why it's counter-attacking. If you don't want to use the Zeta, you don't need to from what I can tell in this event, but you may want to just add a little bit of gear on some of the tunes. Okay, so another little wiggle. And we've got one more before Illuminated Destiny. Let's do the AoE. Ooh, okay. Days, that's good. And here we go. Lovely job, lay. Okay, uh, let's do that. Do that. Bit more of uh, the secret intel to float around. Do basics. Lovely. Okay, so tier two's done. 50 more and 40 crystals. Tier three. We're going to use Finn and the Vets. And the description just for record did say defeat Captain Phasma and force her to the lower shields of Starkiller base. So, okay. We're certainly following the Force Awakens a bit here. Right, let's do an AoE. Boink. Hmm, not ideal that he got uh, stunned, but let's just ride with it. We'll do a basic, get rid of the officer. Um, let's do a basic there. Ooh, would have been nice to get a double tap, but no big deal. Do that. Just saving the specials for now. It's a shame we haven't got BB-8, but I'm not too surprised. Uh, let's do the AoE. Uh, do basic again. We're just going to hold back on the specials just in case we need them in the next tier. Or the next wave. Uh, yeah, these these ones seem like a pain. I'm a bit amazed they never came to the game as actual tunes. Um, let's get Exposed going. Get some speed down. Ooh, okay. Right, get rid of that one. Yeah, these uh, rat control stormtroopers really seem annoying. There we go, bye bye. It's only a stun, but it is a little bit irritating because you just won't get rid of them. Okay. So. We got Phasma. Let's uh, do the AoE, bit of uh, stun and day, oh, stun and ability block even. Right, gotta go through the Stormtrooper, unfortunately. Right, if I can get a turn with Finn, I'm going to use his uh, cleanse, but right now it's not the biggest concern I've got. Let's go for this right control, he's going to slow me right down. Okay, we've got a bit of counter attacks, that's nice. AoE. Ooh, okay. <laughs> yeah, like I say, they have really been a pain. Just how many turns he's getting, it's like, can I take a turn, please? <laughs> wow, uh, Chewie, I really need you to hit there, bud. I love how Han's the only one who's hanging around. The AI isn't thick. There we go, okay. Who's in charge now, Phasma? <laughs> I love the little slide dig as if, you know... Uh, anyone who actually properly gears up these characters won't struggle as much as I did there, but because I'm really going under, it's like, yeah, that was harder. <laughs> okay, tier four. We've got Ray Scarf, Finn, and veteran smuggler Chewbacca. So, um, yeah, I agree with what was said at the time of the release of this event. They did drop a ball and not actually doing what we should have seen for tier 4. But, um, ah well. Uh, defeat the attacking first order forces, finish planting explosives to destroy the thermal oscillator and cripple star killer base. Fair enough. Uh, yeah, we've got the right team, let's go. Shame there's no more BB-8. It feels like, a, maybe not wasted as Zeta, because obviously I want that for like GAC, but yeah, it's a bit of a shame we can't use BB more. Okay, so let's finish planting the explosives and get out of here. Ray, we got company. Yep, no big surprise there. Let's get rid of the Stormtrooper if we can. Uh, bye bye. And do that. Nice bit of evasion from Ray. Okay. Uh, that was just rude. Let's do a basic. And I'm going to try and hit this guy. Lovely. And bye bye. So three of five, 
Mmm, these ones, lovely. Um, bye bye. Lovely. Okay, so smooth so far. We've gotta get rid of this one. One attack. Bye bye. And nearly there. Yes, okay. Way five. How difficult are you gonna be? Ooh, okay, so we've got a riot one again. Let's do that, I won't keep him quiet. Okay. If I'm not talking through the abilities much, I'm not going to hide. I don't really know the vets too well. I mean, again, I haven't used them in GAC much because they haven't been built well. Um, I do know the general gist of the abilities. So this one lands exposed. That's a cleanse. So you basically want to use it like that. As, you, as you've been seeing during the gameplay, this one dispels all buffs and stuns with also a chance to apply speed down, 85% chance. So yeah, uh, they're all good kits to a degree. They're better now they're actually resistance before they were just scoundrels, but um, yeah, it's like they could just do with maybe a little punch up still, but they're very useful. Okay, we'll do the cleanse. Lovely. Get rid of that. Right, let's get to expose on the field. Do a basic. And do a basic again. And let's do that. Number expose. We'll do the basic there. Try and smack him. Lovely. Okay, that one's got more to me, so we're going to do this. For the record, leverage. It uh, grants foresight to race, so that's why I use that one whenever it's available. I think I might have said that earlier. I can't remember off the top of my head, but um, here we go. Basic. And get rid of that one, bye bye. So, I feel like this event's going nice and smooth. Even with undergeared characters, I feel like I'm doing okay. So, yeah, another 50 shards. And have we got two tiers left? Two after this, okay. Escape the thermal oscillator and get back to Millennium Falcon. All right. It really feels like we were given weird requirements for this just as i mean i'm looking at this several years on but i'm thinking we seem to only be using three characters for the most part bit of a shame uh ray i can't believe he's dead oh, okay so this is when it's happened we have to keep moving okay <laughs> i think Jews as disappointed as us okay uh let's go for the officer and let's get an expose on the field and do that. And now we've got that one as well. So we're going to do a big hit there. And let's land and expose if we can. Yep. Do a basic. Bye bye. And bye bye officer. And bye bye stormtrooper. Wave two. Hmm. Okay, we need to keep the riot control stormtrooper down. So let's do that. And we're going to give him a big hit. 19,000. Big hit. <laughs> um, let's get an expose again. Basic. And a basic. Hmm. Could really do a fin getting a turn pronto. Right, get rid of that. There we go. Heal up a little. Would like to bit more. Ooh, okay. This fin is looking really squishy. Bye bye, fin. Wow. I wasn't expecting losing. And we got one tier left, so this ain't good. Yeah, this ain't good. I bet Chewie's uh, got to ride this for me. That ain't happening by the looks of it. Nope. Okay. That wasn't good. Okay, so... I'm going to see if I can do it again, and hopefully I haven't got to do a montage on the YouTube video. Hopefully not. Can we do that? Oh. Yeah, we lost Finn again. Oh. Yeah, I'm not riding this. Okay, looks like a remod's in order. Okay, so I have worked out what I want to try. 
So Finn is going to get uh, Mon Mothma's mod set. So where are you, Mon? There we go. That bumps his speed up quite drastically. Plus he's got a bit of tenacity so he isn't getting stunned so easily. Then Vet is going to get Thrones. It's pretty bad that Thrones didn't have any 6 dot mods on him, but I'll overlook that for now. He's got a bit of a speed bump. That should help him out, plus a little extra health. Then if we go to Ray, Ray is going to get uh, Pows. So where are you, Pow? There we go. I just want upper damage. So she's got a bit of speed, crit damage, potency. So hopefully that'll help her out. So, ooh, saying that, can I give an ability map with that help as well? Ooh, yeah, we've got damage. Yeah, let's just apply them as well, make sure that uh, we're not scrimping on those. Can I afford to do anything on Finn or... No, leave the basic. And Vet Chewy. Hmm. Okay, so I'm going to apply that speed down on all our enemies is good. Okay, so we'll do that. Resistance Rapport is good, and I don't want to just do a base damage. So, you've seen a few of the upgrades I've done there. Let's go. I can't believe he's dead. We have to keep moving. Chewy roll. <laughs> okay, um, I'm going to go for the Stormtroops, because the officer's just still going to take a turn. So, let's do... Let's do that. Try and slow that one down. And bye-bye. And let's do that. Lovely. And do that. And that. I won't do a basic, just hold on for the next wave. There we go. I really hope the remod works here. Um, I'm tempted to go there, so let's do that. Yeah, got an evade. That was good. Um, let's get an expose there. And because we got that, let's do this. Lovely. Um, let's get rid of... Well, let's get rid of that. Let's do this. And do this. Exposes it all on the field. I'm loving it. Let's get to Foresight on Ray. And come on, that's it. We got past it with all three. So, progress. If anything, that is what the mods will do. So, I'm glad about it. Let's get to Expose there. Let's get speed down on the team. Uh, do a basic. Uh, I'd like more, but for now I'm going to do a basic. And another basic. Uh, we're going to be stuck there a minute. Alright, um, let's get an expose. Let's do that. I think we may be stuck for a moment. Let's get that on. Uh, we've got two buffs, so I can do big damage here, in theory. Uh, let's get rid of that taunt. Lovely. Okay, let's get exposed there. Bones protection isn't great there, but we're just going to fried it. Um, I really wish I'd got more going around me, but I'm just going to have to try and keep uh, hitting them all in equal measure. Um, let's do that. And that. I like keeping that one quiet. Oh, 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 okay. Let's do that. I think we're nearly here. We've just got to keep this one quiet now. There we go. We've got a stun. We should be fine here. That was close. That one was close. Whew. Okay, but we got through it. We got three stars as well. So it was worth just a little bit of remodding. So a little bit of advice for anyone trying to under undergear it. You don't really want to do it. <laughs> okay, seven star characters. Ray Scav, Finn. Fight Kylo Ren to escape the Starkiller base. Now, I know what happens here, unfortunately. This way... You know, the event being out for so long, it's impossible not to know, really. So, I'm just going to try and enjoy this. We're not done yet. You're a monster. Yeah, I, I'm not worrying here, like I say. It's like, this ain't going to go well. <laughs> okay, I did half decent damage there. Uh, let's do that. He has got his Kylo kit as well, that's interesting. Uh, expose. Uh, let's do that. <laughs> and that. 
This ain't gonna do anything. Well, at least right now it ain't. <laughs> oh, I got. I, I, I did miss that. I, I did miss the button. Yeah, um. Awaken. <laughs> okay. Apologies for that if you had a little rumble then. Um, hopefully, I did it out. But yeah. I do like that. I think they nailed that bit. Again, I'm with the majority though. I feel like Han and Kylo needed a needed a moment. Anyway, Ray Scab versus Kylo. Let's do it. We've got an event unit. <laughs> Gear 12, thankfully. <laughs> you need a teacher. I can show you the ways of the Force. The Force? Um, what are we doing? Leverage. Deal physical damage to target enemy. Oh, okay, so it's... Pretty close to what we've got already. What's the basic? Let's do the basic. Okay, we're going nice and slow here, apparently. Let's get Foresight up. And just do a basic again. We want to try and keep Foresight up, so then we can do that. Uh, let's do a basic again, get Foresight. And there he goes. <laughs> Probably... A bit like the jewel in the actual film, but I will take that. 30 shards. And we've done it. So, before I actually unlock her, I'm going to just tick off these. Beat Ray's Hero Journey Tier 1. And reunite Ray with Ray's friends. So, with all that done, let's unlock her. I have finally got Ray Jedi training. Uh, it, to anyone who's been playing this for four or five years, you know, it, it, this is laughable that I'm actually relishing this. I mean, she is subpar now compared to a lot of the legendaries or Eero's journey of characters, but she's going to be useful in the raids for me. I'm going to be able to get Jedi Master Luke at some point by getting it to Relic 7. So there is a purpose for me investing time into getting her. So, with that in mind, let's take her up to level 85. And let's see how far we can take her. Okay, nice. 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 Ooh, first roadblock. What does she need? Ooh, um, I've done my energy recently, so I don't think I'm going to be able to get this. Ooh, we got a bit of luck. Nice. So, craft that, and let's carry on. Nice. Ooh, we're having to stop at gear 7, which is a bit unfortunate, but mm, these things do happen. So, I'll do the ability maps in a bit. I haven't got Zeta lined up for it, because I didn't actually plan to do this today. I'm on 8 out of 20 there. So, the only one I really need is Inspirational Presence. I, I've heard that Insight is the next best, but... I'm going triple Zeta. I, I will do that with all these legendaries and uh, heroes journeys and whatnot. So she will get the star treatment. So with that in mind, thank you very much for watching this video. You're going to be able to see Radio Air training in my future GAC matches. So if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel so you can catch them. Other than that, this has been Josh from JJ's Productions and I'll catch you next time. Bye for now, folks.